we are, um, beginning of July, plenty of summer left to escape the Texas heat. Steve Noviello has done all the work for us. He joins us now with some amazing Oh, it's, it's even easier than that. He got somebody else <laughs> to do the work for him. <laughs> Talk about work smarter, not harder. Yeah, the credit today goes to Gabe Saglia, the senior editor of Travel Zoo. We're talking about summer travel, and I have to start with yeah. uh, even a simple road trip for the family. Gas prices down this summer. Lowest really gas prices since 2009, good so chance hitting the road. Folks. Where, what are the destinations? I mean, is it those those traditionally business uh, travel places yeah. because there's not a whole lot of business going on? Well, look what? at big cities. It's happening in Dallas. It's certainly happening in New York City, Chicago, San Francisco. Uh, business travel slows in the summer, plus international travel is slowed this summer because the dollar is stronger against the euro, against the Canadian dollar, against the Japanese yen. So fewer international uh, travelers moving into these big cities. And really the vacation rental market, the Airbnbs, yeah, the flip keys, the homeaways have really become a competitor in a lot of these big so cities. It drives down the price down for hotel rooms because they're now competing with exactly everybody right. who's renting out their rooms. All right, let's talk about some vacation spots. Starting with Scottsdale, Arizona. It's a little hot. It is hot, but you but can you get know, a good deal. Anywhere where there's a desert uh, and the, the, the temperatures cross that century mark, boy, pr prices come down. This is an absolutely gorgeous property. It's the uh, uh, in Monte Lucia in Scottsdale, Arizona, the Omni Scottsdale Resort and Spa. Five-star property, Moroccan-inspired. Rates down to $129 a night, uh, and that is 50% off, including weekends all the way through September, you've got more than 200 golf courses nearby. Incredible. But you want to do the golf course thing early in the morning. Yes, right? and also in Arizona, Tucson, a great place to go. So this is a great family friendly, if, especially as multi-generational trips become very popular. This is a place uh, called the White Stallion Ranch, about 30 minutes outside of uh, Tucson. Uh, all your meals included, all your activities like the horseback riding, the stargazing, uh, $13.99 for a three night stay for a family of four. And again, all those activities, all your meals, all those uh, very cowboy inspired experiences included there. And that's a deal you can do all the way through the end of the summer. All right, kind of keeping with our desert theme here, we're talking about Las Vegas. Vegas. It is incredible to me. There's such an inventory in yeah. Vegas. How cheap you can get a room. The SLS, forty-seven dollars. Yeah, and this is a hotel that opened up just at the end of last year. I stayed there. This used to be the Sahara for yeah, six yeah, decades. They spent close to a half billion dollars revamping it, and yeah, it rates down to forty-seven dollars a night because again, fewer international travelers. Plus, about four or five new hotels opened up last year, so this extra inventory has really kicked prices down. Go online, make sure you don't go when conventions come into Vegas, right. which slow down anyway in the summer season, and you're getting rates. I mean, we're seeing four-star hotel rates even under $30 a night. Uh, so you pick your dates wisely, you bring a little luck with you, and it's a bargain proposition. You know, I have Vegas. to say, this particular property, uh, the Sahara, of course, legendary with the Rat yep. Pack, they didn't just slap on some paint here. I mean, nope. this was a full renovation of this property. $450 really million, nice dollars, and a lot of these brand new hotels have really sort of, I mean, they, the, the, the luxury aspect remains high. It's just that there's just a lot of inventory, so the consumer is enjoying some, some big bargains. All right, let's take things to Florida. Tell me about it. So this is a slow season in Florida because, again, it's a bit of a muggier time of year, right. so all these beautiful resorts go on sale. This is in the Florida Keys, one of only six four diamond resorts in the Florida Keys. This is the Chica Lodge and Spa. They've got a beautiful 1,200 foot private beach. Just a fantastic uh, couples getaway. Uh, 179 a night. That's half off buffet breakfast. Welcome cocktails. There's a $25 resort fee that's usually part of the deal. That's waived with this deal. Anyway, summer uh, getaways to Florida on sale right now. All right, we've got two more destinations, one in St. Thomas, the other one also in the Caribbean in the Bahamas. We'll have them listed both on our website. Again, Gabe, always hey, a pleasure to see, to see you. Thanks so much. All Thanks right. for the deals. Back to you guys.